what is going on people it is friday this is a right now credit results friday in this episode we are going to talk about interest to debt owner to slave stay tuned So, not a, so I know a lot of people don't really have an idea of what interest is. Let me give you a quick breakdown of what interest is. Interest is when your money means you go to work every day. Money comes, you get paid once a week, twice a week, however often you get paid. And your money, the money that you make, makes somebody else more money than what it makes you. Interest is when your money makes somebody else more money than it makes you. Case in point, best example I can give. You get a car loan. The car costs $12,000. After interest, you pay. <laughs> $24,000. Interest made you pay somebody else's way to go to college. Interest made it possible for you to put somebody else's kid through school. Interest. Because the car was $12,000. If you would have went in there with cash, it would have been no interest. You would have paid twelve, dollars But because you had interest on that, you are now paying twice as much because of interest debt is caused by interest if you to pay the 12,000 in cash that would have been your car hands down flat out no questions about it but because you had to get a loan to get the car you now pay interest that interest now puts you in debt do you see the connotation between a interest to debt interest slave owner debt slave so, i mean i don't I, that's how it came to me that way i think i got it from my mentor i'm sure i did but that's how it came to me um we three ways three ways to break the cycle of debt number one is you have to people you have to change your mindset you have to get it in your head that you are going to beat this and you have to stick with it i remember when i quit smoking cigarettes i quit smoking black and miles i made a decision that i was not going to use them anymore i was not going to smoke anymore and i stuck to it and with the with my will to stick to it and the grace of God, I'm about four or five years in now, no cigarettes, no black amounts. So you have to make it up in your mind that this is what you want to do. You want to get out of debt. That is the first step in getting out of debt. The second step is distinguish your wants from your needs. You don't <laughs> you don't need everything that you want, people. You know. You want a big house. You want a nice car. You want the J's. You want the chains. You want the earrings. You want the clothes. And when I say these things, I mean on the expensive side. I understand you need some of that stuff, but you don't have to get J's. You can go to Walmart. <laughs> I mean, truth be known. You know what I'm saying? I can't lie. I got a few pair of less pairs of shoes back there. I'm not going to lie about it. I just, you know what I'm saying? I got some J's too, though. You know, but I caught them on sale. They real hot, and I got them for a real low price. So, you know what I'm saying? Bargain shop, people. Bargain shop. <laughs> but you have to be able to distinguish your wants from your needs. And the third thing is you have to attack your debt with all-out massive action. Meaning, if you really want to get out of debt, every loose fund that you have to, to put on to get you out of debt that is where it has to go to. If every loose end that you have is twenty dollars after you, you know, after you pay yourself, pay your bills, 
if what you have is twenty dollars, you need to apply that in some way, shape, form, or fashion in a way to get you out of debt. I am not by far the credit consultant, the debt counselor, or your um, a budgeting tool. What I do offer is a as access to these things to these people. If you want help in in accomplishing credit repair, um, budgeting, and debt consolidation, click the link below, and we'll get you there. Cause I I'm you know call me the plug. I'm the middleman. I just wanna I wanna help you out the best way possible to get your situation handled. So if you got value out of this, like comment share if you would like more information click the link below up top on the side i don't know where it's at click it anyways because it's going to be there y'all have a wonderful day did i say this is larry this is larry b hawkins jr also known as hawk y'all have a wonderful day peace if you got value out of this like comment and share if you would like more info feel free to visit my website at workwithlarryhawkins.com leave a comment or send a message you all have a wonderful day peace